Hey guys, MJ here from Nightcore Singapore. So we're here at Minipo Expo. The Nightcore booth is here. We're gonna walk through some of the very cool new stuff that they have on display. So I just walk you through what's available. Right here we got all the tools and lights for law enforcement. Where right? we got the new headlamps here. You can see it's mounted on the front mount. If you need that, we got also side mounts as well. This is the NU06 LE blue and red flashing here then we got the new MT1C Pro so you can see they have a, sort of a small one for backup and a big one as your main light right different sizes also MT2A Pro highly recommended for travel this runs on AA as well all the rechargeable built-in they got EDC 35 right also another staple right we demoed this before then we got the EMR10 mosquito repellent that can be powered by power bank so also one of the very common request from the law enforcement side. So over here, we got the whole EMR series, electronic mosquito repellent. So the difference with these against the other fuel-based ones, that these are all rechargeable. So if you look under here, you can see the recharge port. These are all battery-powered. So battery-powered heating element, right? You don't have to mess with uh, fuels and all the kind of things. Out of all the repellents here, half of them have built-in batteries, so you can run it without any power bank then some can also be run with a power bank so you can extend the lifetime of your repellent right then if you need to replace the mats these are how the mats look like so when it's blue right it's uh, full when it's become faded like this a bit white then that's the time you need to change the mat to a new mat replacement mats are available in these boxes of 30 here so we have all of these available on nightclubs.com as spares as you need if you need them right over here we got all the nb10k power bank range so the most interesting one would be this one right the new carbon battery 6000 milliampere very very tiny actually right it's usb-c rechargeable so this you'll see later on that this will be used in all the headlamp models you can also use this to power your phone you can power the emr repellents magsafe once here this is only uh, 5000 milliampere but it's ridiculously small and light 10000 milliampere summit version so those you see with the summit there's a heating element so this will work when it's in very cold temperatures as well. Carbon 10K and carbon 20K, so 10,000 milliampere and 20,000 milliampere. All carbon single unit built, okay? Then we move on to the NB10K V2. So these are still using the single panel carbon piece. So these are complete carbon all around, whereas these only have two carbon plates. So you'll find that the prices on these carbo 10 and 20K are more expensive, and that's the reason why, because it costs more to manufacture. Right, the difference between these two MB10Ks are black and silver only. Okay, and over here we have all the rechargeable batteries. So Nightcore is moving towards larger batteries but with a built in recharge port. Right, so you can save on the chargers and all that. Right, you just plug directly into the battery and then you charge it. So they have it for every different size. You got your CR123 size, 18650 size, you got 21700 high capacity and USB C port rechargeable. All right, this is where my core is going. Nano BB Blower. So this has been very, very well received. You've got your vacuum attachment here and your blower attachment here. So these can be connected. And you have a bunch of different attachments as well. Now over here we have the best seller. So these will be the UV lights. You got your CI7 infrared right cu6 uv in white light then you got the mt21c which is currently the only right angle light in nightcore then they have the magnetic magnetic tail cap here right so this and these are the two most recommended work lights is the nwr20 both of them all have hooks right this one you have the hook here as well and they're all magnetic all of them are of course waterproof down to two meters so you got this thing to show. This row is the most interesting. These are all the new lights from Nightcore. So first up will be the MT1C Pro and MT2C Pro. So these you realize are super small and super handy. So what is good about this is they don't have any secondary mode button. It's only on off. And when it's on off, it's only two brightness levels, low and high. Right? There's no fiddling with any kind of controls. Another thing is there's no external USB charging port. Right, when you open, you realize it's also using the 18650 but USB-C rechargeable. Right, so one of the problems with building USB-C charging ports, the light charging mechanic might die. Right, so then you need to buy an external charger. Whereas this, 
once the battery dies or the charging fault spoils, you can just switch a new battery and your light is as good as new. So that's one of the new value props for this uh, MT. 2C and MT1C Pro. I don't have pricing on these yet, but these will be available soon and also on a deep dive video on the YouTube channel and on nightcolights.com. Okay, moving onwards, we got the, the very popular MT2A Pro. So I did cover this on the channel before and earlier, right? Very amazing travel light. Then we got the MH12 Pro and MH25 Pro. So these are again the longest running lights in night course range, right? Up to four hours on both and the only difference between 12 and 25 is the bezel size so the smaller ones will can't, can't shine as far so it's about 500 meters beam distance where this one will go up to 700 meters beam distance right this is the MH12 and MH25 Pro series the newest series will be the TM9K Pro right this uses all the new UHI LEDs so you realize the older TM9K had a bunch of LEDs inside but now they are condensed into three big ones with many many little micro LEDs inside so they follow the same principle as the EDC 33 and 35 right micro LEDs so they're actually 27 <laughs> LEDs in total here they also comes with a new dual stage steel cap switch here so half press and full press and you got you whoa there was 9000 lumens on full turbo we'll deep dive into this in a later video and also this available on nightcolights.com the last would be the EDC 35 EDC 33 so we did cover these before, these are the built-in battery series along with this. These are all built-in batteries. So those of you that are complaining that you hate built-in batteries, you can go for the other series, the MH12 Pro, MT2C Pro, right? All these are replaceable batteries. But for those of you that don't mind built-in batteries, these will be the most interesting and the latest ones. What's also new will be this EDC25. Right, so this, if you compare it with the older EDC27, right, both have the same shape but they remove the LCD here to cut on cost and also the UI is simplified so this how it works right left side shows the battery the right side shows output right just change brightness it's a very simple very economical there's nothing that can go wrong on this side right? very little points of failure again USB-C recharging port here same as the older EC27 last newest entry will be the MPL 25 weapon light. So the previous weapon lights had to, you got to unscrew and remove and change the CR123 battery, but this comes with a swappable battery here, like this. Right, so just magnetically recharge this and then swap it back in and then you're good to go. Right, the runtime is about 30 minutes on each charge, but that's okay because for ops, you're not going to run it on for 30 minutes all the way through the, your ops, right? You're going to be using it on momentary this way. Right, so the controls wise, left and right ambidextrous, no problem if you're left-handed or right-handed. You tap once to have it constant on or you can hold for momentary, right? This way, okay? Both hands. Right, it's the new MPL25, which is over on to the headlamps. Right, we've got a whole series of mini beacon lights. We've got the NU06LE for law enforcement version. So if you're asking what's the difference between NU06, LE is law enforcement. MI is military. So military is the only one with IR lights in here. Okay? Then we've also got the NU07LE. The only difference between these smaller ones and the bigger 07 would be the yellow light here. Alright, moving on. These are also the new headlamps. Uh, HT65 UHE, the consumer version has a headband strap, which you'll see later. Whereas the M means military version, so theirs comes with a mount for the front of the helmet. MT10C side helmet mounts. If you don't want to have it mounted in front, you can just put it on the side, right? Then mix onto the consumer level headlamp. So when it comes to headlamps, Nightcore splits it very clearly into three main types. One is the super lightweight ones, which are here, right? HA11, A25. These are not as bright, right? You go up to 400 lumens, and but very, very light. Okay, these are for the runners, ultra marathon. So the next up will be the higher performance one. So brighter lumens, uh, larger battery, longer run time. So these will go up to 1,400 lumens. These are the NU series here. The last and most rugged ones will be the brightest ones. HC series are all the heavy duty metal built ones. Right, these go up to 2,000 lumens, 2,700 lumens even. Right, these are whole series. Okay, so that's it. These are all the things that you can see at Millipole. Expo 2024. All the new lights will have deep dive videos on them very soon. And you can find everything on nightcolights.com. Also, a big shout out to Ceremonic for sending us these new remote mics. Right, these come in 
pairs, right? You can have the main unit connected to the camera, then you get your two side units that you can attach to two different people so you can record audio clearly and cleanly. So you realize we are in a expo kind of environment, there are all kinds of noise, people talking, but if you hear my voice throughout the video, it's actually quite clear. So this is what Ceremonic does. If you're interested to get one, you can find the links to order these Ceremonic mics in the description box down below.